This video is in loving memory of those 28 actors who have sadly passed away from Star Trek The Original Series. Let's get started. Number 1. DeForest Kelly DeForest played the role of Dr. Leonard Bones McCoy on the USS Enterprise in the original Star Trek series from 1966. He died on the 11th of June, 1999, at the age of 79 after a long battle with stomach cancer. Number 2. James Doohan James Doohan played the role of Montgomery Scotty Scott in 1966. He died on the 20th of July 2005 at the age of 85 of pneumonia and Alzheimer's disease. Number 3. Majel Barrett Majel Barrett Roddenberry was the wife of Star Trek's creator, Gene Roddenberry, and played the role of Dr. Slash Nurse Christine Chapel, number 1, Luoxana Troy, and voiced most onboard computer interfaces. She died on the 18th of December 2008 at the age of 76 of leukemia. Number 4. Leonard Nimoy Leonard Nimoy played the role of Spock, the first Vulcan officer and only non-human on the Enterprise spaceship for about 50 years. He died on the 27th of February 2015 at the age of 83 at his Bel Air home of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, brought about by years of smoking despite him stopping the habit three decades before his death. Number 5. Grace Lee Whitney Grace Lee Whitney played a major recurring role of yeoman Janice Rand on the original Star Trek film and subsequent Star Trek films. She died on the 1st of May 2015 at the age of 85 of natural causes. Number 6. Anton Yelchin Anton Viktorovich Yelchin played the role of Chekhov in Star Trek in 2009. He met his tragic death on the 19th of June 2016 at the young age of 27 due to blunt traumatic asphyxia in a freak accident whereby his car set in neutral gear, rolled down and crushed him against a security gate at his home in Los Angeles, California. Number 7. Aaron Eisenberg Aaron Eisenberg played the role of Nog the Ferengi, who was Jack Sisko's friend and Quark's nephew throughout all seven seasons of Star Trek Deep Space Nine from 1993 to 1999. He died on the 21st of September 2019 at the age of 50 of heart failure. Number 8. Rene Auberjonas Rene Auberjonas played the role of Otto, a shape-shifting chief of security in Star Trek Deep Space Nine from 1993 to 1999. He died on the 8th of December 2019 at the age of 79 of metastatic lung cancer. Number 9. Robert Walker Jr. Robert Walker Jr. played the role of Charlie Evans on the Star Trek episode Charlie X in 1966. He died on the 5th of December 2019 at the age of 79 of undisclosed reasons at his home in Malibu, California. Number 10. Sally Kellerman Sally Claire Kellerman starred in the second pilot of Star Trek as a psychiatrist, who studied the long-term effects of space on a crew named Elizabeth Denner. She died on the 24th of February 2022 at the age of 84 due to heart failure, and she also had dementia. Number 11. Yvonne Craig Yvonne Joyce Craig played the role of the green-skinned Orion slave girl named Marta in the Star Trek episode Whom Gods Destroy. She died on the 17th of August 2015 at the age of 78 of breast cancer that had spread to her liver. Number 12. Sid Hag Sid Hag played a small role appearing as the first lawgiver in the Star Trek original series in the episode named The Return of the Acorns. He died on the 21st of September 2019 at the age of 80 of Aspergillus pneumonia when he aspirated vomited in his sleep. Number 13. Michael Ansara Michael Ansara had a recurring role of Klingon Commander Kang on three different Star Trek TV series, namely the original Star Trek film in 1968, Deep Space Nine in 1994, and Voyager in 1996. He died on the 31st of July 2013 at the age of 91 after a prolonged bout of Alzheimer's disease. Number 14. William Wyndon William Wyndon starred as Commodore Matt Decker on the Star Trek original series on the second episode of The Doomsday Machine in 1967, as well as the fan series Star Trek Voyages in 2004. He died on the 16th of August 2012 at the age of 88 of congestive heart failure. Number 15. William Campbell William Campbell appeared in the Star Trek original film and Deep Space Nine as Klingon Captain Koleth. He died on the 28th of April 2011 at the age of 87 of natural causes. 
Number 16, Ricardo Montalban. Richard Montalban played the role of Khan Noonien and Singh in Star Trek II The Wrath of Khan in 1982, a reprised role for the original Star Trek series. He died on the 14th of January 2009 at the age of 88 of congestive heart failure. Number 17, Lee Berger. Lee starred in the Star Trek original series third season episode The Savage Curtain as the Excalbian's recreation of Abraham Lincoln. He died on the 31st of January 2007 at the age of 88 years old of undisclosed causes. Number 18, Jane Wyatt. Jane Wyatt appeared as Amanda Grayson, who was Spock's mother in one episode of the original Star Trek series called Journey to Babel, and a single scene of Star Trek IV The Voyage Home. She died on the 20th of October 2006 at the age of 96 in her sleep of natural causes brought out by old age. Number 19, Frank Gorshin. Frank John Gorshin Jr. appeared in a single episode of Star Trek original series as an alien named Bell who was a bigoted half-white face, half-black face from planet Charon. He died on the 17th of May, 2005 at the age of 72, having suffered from pneumonia, emphysema, and lung cancer. Number 20, John Colicos. John Colicos portrayed the first Klingon ever seen named Commander Kor in the episode Errand of Mercy in 1967. He died on the 6th of March, 2000, at the age of 71, after a series of heart attacks. Number 21, Persis Kambata. Persis Kambata appeared as the bald Lieutenant Elia in Star Trek The Motion Picture. She died on the 18th of August, 1998, at the age of 49, due to a massive heart attack after complaining of severe chest pains. Number 22, Mark Leonard. Mark Leonard played numerous roles including Spock's father, Sarek, and Romulan in the original Star Trek series, as well as Klingon in Star Trek Motion Picture. He died on the 22nd of November 1996 at the age of 72 of multiple melioma. Number 23, Bibi Besh. Bibi played Dr. Kara Marcus, the early love of James T. Kirk in Star Trek II The Wrath of Khan in 1982. She died on the 7th of September 1996 at the age of 54 of breast cancer. Number 24, Jeffrey Hunter. Jeffrey Hunter starred as Captain Christopher Pike in the pilot episode of the original Star Trek series. He tragically died on the 27th of May 1969 at a young age of 42 due to intracranial hemorrhage and skull fracture caused by a strike to the head when he fell and hit the stair banister in his home. Number 25, Roger C. Carmel. Roger C. Carmel played Harcourt Fenton Harry Mudd in two episodes of the original Star Trek series, namely Mudd's Woman and I Mudd, as well as one episode of the animated series of Star Trek. He died on the 11th of November 1986 at the age of 54 of hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, caused by a narcotics overdose. Number 26, Merritt Buttrick. Merritt Buttrick was cast to play David Marcus, appearing in Star Trek II Wrath of Khan in 1982 and Star Trek III The Search for Spock in 1984. He died on the 7th of March 1989 at the young age of 29 of toxoplasmosis, complicated by AIDS. Number 27, Susan Oliver. Susan Oliver starred as a female lead guest character called Vina, who appeared as the Orion Slave Girl. She died on the 10th of May, 1990, at the age of 58 of colorectal cancer that later metastasized her lungs. Number 28, Jill Ireland. Jill Dorothy Ireland appeared in the single episode of Star Trek called The Side of Paradise as Leela Colomi in 1967. She died on the 18th of May, 1990, of breast cancer at the age of 54 years. Thanks for watching.